Maven flux. I walk past a skyscraper, stubby thing, with the words JP Morgan precariously suspended against its windows, so high up. I'd walk past and through every day on my way to another place. I never stop there. These funny little monoliths scattered in our city and others like it. Names of people, things so big, the name bigger than the space it truly inhabits. And as I crossed the bridge, turning to look at that name, I found my own name growing bigger. Now in a club, I feel my heart pulsing with a thousand other hearts. So this is the rhythm that dissolves names, blurs their edges. From and to these places I walk, a traveller whose name patiently awaits in flux. Oh, the places I've been. By the frumples in my coat and the tethered schmeeps in my hair. I'm often asked this question, how did you get there? Whether it's inside a sealed crate or deep beneath the ocean floor, I'm found in strange places ready to explore. I was once found on the moon, riding with a pack of grimbles. They grow to the size of buses but they start out the size of thimbles. I was once found deep in the caves of Grell, caverns filled with an overwhelming burning smell. The source, deep underground lava beaches, inhabited by the bat-like screeches. Whilst their name does sound terrifying, let me assure you that it's not the case. They spend their time surfing lava seas, challenging each other to race. The last place I was found was the one most unusual of all, resting in my garden on a deck chair a hundred feet tall. A guitar that took me to outer space. I found an old guitar lying on the bottom stair. It was strange because I'd never seen it there or anywhere before now. Its strings were worn, its body was weak, and along the fretboard a suspicious brown streak. I took it upstairs and gave it a clean, and soon it was a lean, mean acoustic machine. I took it to the garage for a test drive, and as I struck a chord I felt an extraterrestrial vibe. I was pulled upwards, right into the night sky, straight towards the glittering stars I soared so high. I was hurtling towards the moon and continued to play riffs and soon I saw its beauty with all its craters and cliffs. I continued out of orbit, my velocity growing larger, earth that was once close was now much farther. I saw the milky way and the wonders of the cosmos and then suddenly I was back, the guitar now a loss. Its strings had sprung practically beyond repair so I put it back where I found it on the bottom cellar stair. Black blood on digital. Black blood become digital. Black blood become digital.